Hi, this is Shannon with Payroll Solutions Plus. This morning, we are going to show you how to change the unemployment rate that you pay versus what was collected. There's a number of different reasons why your unemployment rate in your QuickBooks desktop payroll software is going to be different than the amount that you actually pay into the state for unemployment. One of the reasons is if you're in Minnesota, you just never know what you're paying until you file your return. And recently, I've been seeing some states have been changing their unemployment rate retroactively. So let's just hop right in. So um, from the home screen, you're going to go to edit your payroll item list and you'll go to your unemployment rate and change your rate here. So say instead of it being 0.1%, it's now 1%. So we'll change it in all the quarters and then hit next. And yes, it's changed change for previous quarter, that's okay. Sometimes I will leave the quarter off. Even if I said, no, we'll just, we'll leave it at 0.1 for quarter one and 1% 1 for quarter two. We've already run payroll in quarter two. So it's going to still give you that same message. We just finished that. 